Welcome back, everyone. Uh, welcome back to another episode of uh, The Isaac Show. Today is uh, episode number three, uh, also known as vlog number three. Um, for those of you who are new to the show, my name is Isaac. Uh, my name is Isaac Gonzalez. Um, I'm an SDSU student. Um, I basically do vlog reports on sports and like sports news and media. Um, for this week's episode, uh, I'm going to start off with the uh, Aztec men's soccer. So, um, yesterday, um, SDSU played UCLA on their last uh, season game of the the, the year. Uh, sadly, they lost 3-0, took a loss at home. Um, wasn't a great way to go out, nor was it a great way to end the season. Um, sadly, this year we didn't do that good. We... Ended off with a 9, 6, and 5 record. Not the best thing you want to see for the Aztec men's, but uh, hopefully next semester or next season, it'll be better. Um, as far as women's soccer, it's the opposite. Uh, it's great to see the women's soccer right now. Uh, they're doing amazing. Um, they tied Colorado State. That is 14-2-0 and 0, uh, for the record. And SSU's 12 four and two um it's on it was a it was a great game i didn't watch it but seeing from the end score which was nil nil uh it's i, I can say it was a beautiful game knowing both teams records and um uh, it's being said that they're both in the pack 12 for mountain west like it, it it can be it couldn't have been a good game i'll be showing clips for both of these uh for uh asset sports that's kind of where it ends um as far as basketball we're not doing the best last year for march madness we were doing amazing we made it to top four uh it's barely the beginning season we lost to byu on thursday night but um not no biggie uh, thursday night or yesterday night but again uh not not that deep of an issue it's only the beginning of the season um can't show any baseball clips or much other as far as men's uh, and women's. Uh, the seasons start like within the next couple weeks. Um, so sadly can't show too much of asset sports, but as far as basketball goes, um, that's the last topic. Uh, it's mainly on one person. He's hit the news liners for NBA like all throughout this month. Uh, he made a uh, great accomplishments. Um, aside from Steph Curry, I'll, um, he, well, Steph Curry is a, the first person that I want to mention before I go towards that person that I was mentioning earlier, who was Trey Young, but Steph Curry hit 22,000 career points. Uh, congrats to him. Not going to show any, uh, images or highlights of him. He just, uh, just like a little fact, he hit 22,000 career points. So congrats to him. But that was aside from the point of the person that I was mentioning earlier, which was, um, Trey Young, um, He made a great accomplishment this um this this month. Uh, congrats to him for having a street named after him, um, Trey Young Drive, and on the street that he was named on named after, he established helped establish a facility, uh, an academy to be specific to allow um students and children of lower income to be able to train and uh, have a place to play um in comparison to when they don't, because uh, some facilities charge, for example, like YMCA uh, gyms, you know, so it was very cool to see that he helps out not only himself, but the community and he represents his city in a, in a, um, in a positive way, because there are some athletes that, you know, like they take it in a whole nother view, like uh, not to say anything wrong with Jean Moran, but like, he wasn't necessarily portraying the best for his community in comparison to Trey Young that seems to be wanting to do a difference and help the future generation. It's, it's great to see. I love to see it. So, yeah, um, I'm going to be showing um, his ceremony, his uh, ceremonial speech. It's uh, going to be about 10 seconds long, just him um, uh, being grateful of the, the street and also of the community. And then I'm going to end it off with uh, the Atlanta Hawks taking a loss or taking the W um, for Trey Young as well. That's uh, where he hit his 900th career three-pointer. So that's nothing but great news for Trey Young. Congrats to him for the street and 900th career three-pointer. 
that's what I will be showing you guys throughout this video. I hope you guys enjoy it and uh, come back next week for uh, another video of uh, Isaac's, um, The Isaac Show. Thank you. That comes late. 87th minute. With less than a minute to go, though, it's Noah Cretier with the magical goal. Settled, but taken by Trevithick. On the run for Castro, has space. Castro slots, scores! There's so many it things that uh, I'm gonna continue to do for this city, but having my own drive and my own street. Uh, hey, if you got one more dose of magic in you, rifles it to Murray, three for the lead, yes. gone! Atlantic goes in front! One